Hello friends, this is Shravan. This is my YouTube channel, Civil Engineering by Shravan. To subscribe my channel, click on subscribe button and click on bell icon for more interesting updates. In this video lecture, I will explain you G plus 8 story vertical setback building with irregular shape part 1 by using StatPro V8A software. In this tutorial, I will explain you modeling part which is related to G plus 8 building. So initially, I will show you the model for that respected G plus 8 story vertical setback building. So click on this start pro software. So this is my vertical setback building G plus 8 story building. I will show you how to model this respected uh, building in start pro software now. Go to start pro software, click on start pro software. The software will be open like this. Click on new project, select spacing option here. So here we need to give the structure name. Just I'm considering it as G plus 8. So save your file location. So here I'm selecting this three dots here. So here I'm selecting G plus 9V. Select OK. So here we need to select the meter as well as the kilo newton is the load. Click on next button, click on finish button. So after that the software will be open like this. So initially we need to keep the structure in front of you. Now we need to go to geometry option, click on run structure wizard option. So here we need to select the model type. So it was selected with the cross models here. Just I am selecting it as frame models. In that frame model we need to select the bay frames option here. Just I am selecting bay frames here. So it will be consisting of length, height, width and number of base along length direction, number of base along height direction, number of base along width direction. So here we need to assume the length of the building. So as per my assumption, just I am taking length of the building will be consisting of 30 meter. Again, I am selecting height of the building, 27 meter. Again, I am selecting width of the building is 12 meter. So after that, we need to assume the number of base along length direction, which is of 10. Again, I am selecting number of base along height direction are 9. Again, I am selecting number of base along width direction are 4. Click on apply button. The model will be open like this. So it will be consisting of 30 meter length and 27 meter height and 12 meter width. Now we need to import this respected model from structure wizard software to StatPro software. So click on cancel button, click on S button, click on OK. Now the model is imported from structure wizard software to StatPro software here. So after that click on hide snap node grid. So keep your structure in 3D view. Now we need to make this respected model to irregularity. So for that initially we need to keep the structure in front of you. So now we need to need delete all unnecessary things here. So here I am selecting all my unnecessary things after two story. So here I am selecting these are my all unnecessary things. Click on delete option, click on S button. So it will delete all the respected beams like this. Now we need to select this respected beams and column section. Click on delete option, click on OK. So click on S button here. So after that we need to delete some more sections here. So here I am selecting this respected sections. Click on delete option. Click on S option. So after this we need to delete all the beam sections here like this. And column sections here. Click on S button. Click on OK. Click on S button. So I will show you this respected model in rendering view now. Click on rendering view option. 3D view. Rendering view option. So click on rendering view. So this is my irregular building. So we need to apply the slab section for this respected vertical setback irregular building. So for that initially we need to keep the structure in front of you. Go to cut section command here. Click on select to view option. Click on OK. So here we need to cut the ground story for this respected building here. Now we need to keep the structure in 3D view. So here we need to assign the slab section for this respected ground story. So for that select add four node plate option. So just I am selecting add 4 node plate, select first point here, second point here, third point here, fourth point here. So after that we need to copy this respected plate to x direction. So select 4 node plate option, select this respected option. We need to copy this respected plate to x direction. So here I am counting this respected numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So go to transitional repeat in x direction. So here I am assuming number of steps are 9. And this step will be consisting of 3 meter. Click on OK. So after that we need to copy this respected plate in J direction also. So select the plate cursor here. Select all these respected plates. Again transitional repeat in Z direction. Number of steps will be consisting of 3. And this step will be consisting of 3 meter. Click on OK. So it will copy this respected plate in this direction also. So after that click on whole structure. Now we need to select the plate cursor. Again we have to select all the plates. We need to copy this respected plate to the remaining two stories here. Go to transitional repeat option again. In Y direction, number of steps will be of 2 and each step will be consisting of 3 meter. Click on OK. So it will copy this respected plate for three stories. Now I will show you this respected model in rendering view. Click on rendering view option. So this is my rendering view for the bottom three stories. 
so after that we need to create the plate section for the remaining fourth story fifth story sixth story so for that select modeling option go to front view again again go to cut section command click on select view option click on ok so here we need to cut this respected portion now i am selecting 3d view so go to geometry here select add four node plate here select first point select second point select third point again select your fourth point so now we need to copy this respected plate to the remaining sections here so initially we need to count this respected x direction plates so it will be consisting of one two three four five six seven number of plates select the plate cursor just i'm selecting this plate transitional repeat x direction number of steps will be of seven each step will be consisting of three meter click on ok again i'm selecting all the plates here we need to give the copy for this respected plates in z direction here go to transitional in z direction number of steps will be of three and each step will be consisting of three meter click on ok so after that we need to click on host structure command now we need to select in front view select the plate cursor here so here i'm selecting this respected plate again go to copy this respected plate to remaining two stories here go to transitional in y direction number of steps will be of two and each step will be consisting of three meter click on ok now we need to create the plate section for this respected section here for that again go to transitional repeat click on selective view option click on ok so here we need to cut this respected portion click on 3d view so here i am selecting the plate cursor here add four node plate option first point second point third point again select the fourth point now we need to copy this respected plate to the remaining five stories so select the plate cursor here next i am selecting this respected plate transitional repeat in x direction number of steps will be consisting of five and each step will be consisting of three meter click on ok so it will copy the plates here like this now select all the plates here go to transitional repeat in z direction number of steps will be consisting of three and each step will be consisting of three meter click on ok so it will create the plate like this so click on host structure command again we have to select the front view option now we need to create the plate section for the remaining two stories go to select transitional repeat select to view click on ok so here we need to cut this respected portion select the 3d view click on add four node plate option select the first point here select the second point here select the third point again i am selecting fourth point here go to select the plate cursor here next i am selecting this respected plate again transitional in x direction number of steps will be of one and each step will be consisting of three meter click on ok again i am selecting all the plates here transitional repeat in z direction we need to copy this respected plate to the remaining three steps here each step will be consisting of three meter here click on ok go to select the host structure here so after that we need to copy this respected plate to the remaining remaining story so for that select front view select this respected plate so go to transitional repeat in y direction number of steps will be one and each step will be consisting of three meter click on ok now i will show you this respected model in rendering view so for that select isometric view initially so click on whole structure command again select the rendering view option so this is my rendering view for this respected building so it will be consisting of vertical setbacks to the right hand side section which is of eight story building so now we need to add the properties for this respected structure so for that initially we need to define the beam size column size as well as slab thickness so select general option here click on define option here select the rectangular section so here i am considering 0.5 cross 0.3 is my beam size click on add button again i am adding 0.5 cross 0.5 is the column size click on add button close option select the thickness option so here i am taking 0.150 is the slab thickness for this respected building so now click on close option select 0.5 by 0.3 we need to assign this respected 0.5 by 0.3 for the beam sections here so for that initially we need to select the beams which are parallel to x direction condition again i am selecting the beams which are parallel to z direction condition click on assign to selected beams option assign yes so after that we need to select 0.5 by 0.5 go to select option beams parallel to y axis click on assign to selected beams assign yes so it will assign the column sections here now select the plate thickness with the help of assign to view option assign yes 
so it will assign a plate thickness for this respected structure like this now i will show you this respected whole model in rendering view click on rendering view option so this is my rendering view for this respected building it will be consisting of 0.3 plus 0.5 is the beam size and 0.5 is the 0.5 is the column size slab thickness will be consisting of 150 mm for this respected section so after modeling process completed we need to assign the supports for this respected building at the base so further select modeling option click on general again again select the supports here so initially we need to create the fixed supports here click on create option select the fixed support click on add button select the support to with the help of front view option we need to assign all the node points at the base select isometric view again so it was selected with all node points click on assign to selected nodes assign yes so this is the modeling process for this respected g plus 8 story vertical setback building so in my upcoming videos i will explain you designing part for this respected tutorial one big announcement for our subscribers and viewers our channel was successfully got uh, paid promotions with your support so those who are really want to become a professional in uh, structural engineering architectural engineering as well as civil engineering this is the right choice for you to become a professional so i was introduced three paid promotions which is of a silver one gold one as well as diamond one i will provide you benefits which are related to silver one gold one as well as diamond one in my next video i will explain you what are the benefits that i am providing for the paid promotion so if you want to learn something about structural engineering as well as drafting engineering so this is the right choice to become a professional so thanks for your support thank you